Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. So today I want to share with you everything I just recently purchased at Walgreens. I feel that the drugstore has so many items now that are so good. So when I go in there, there's always something new and I love to browse and the prices are always great. So um, to start off with, I purchased this. It's the L'Oreal Shake and Glow Dew Mist for your face. What you do is you shake it and then you spray on your face. It's a nice scent. It's kind of sweet smelling and I think it does give you a dewy finish to your face. Um, it's quite good. It's good for travel. You just want to throw it in your purse, extra hydration or like a little bit of glow during the day. I like the size. I don't know if they'll come out with a larger size. This is the Lumi line from L'Oreal and it's the Shake and Glow Dew Mist. I really love this item. And then something else from L'Oreal that I picked up. I needed a good concealer, something that was going to cover the darkness that I have around my eyes. I don't really have it underneath. It's right in the corners there that I have darkness. And I thought this was great to purchase and it did not fail. It's called More Than Concealer. It's the Infallible Full Wear from L'Oreal. And I purchased number 320 Porcelain. It's kind of light, but I needed something light to cover the darkness. And it lasts literally all day. Uh, it will not budge. So I was very happy with this purchase. I've been using it every day and I feel that it's going to last quite a while because the um, container is quite large. So I was happy with that. Um, and then another item I purchased, this is from Wet n Wild. It's called Hello Halo. It's a liquid highlighter and uh, Mega Glow. Um, I wasn't too crazy about this when I first used it. It kind of disappeared on the skin. So I don't know. I wasn't too crazy about it, even though it looks like amazing right there. I don't know. Maybe I'm not using it right. So I got um, number 309B Goddess Glow. And that's what it looks like. I don't know if you can see that. Um, but I wasn't in, that impressed with it. I think that it just kind of disappears on the skin. And um, I don't know. I, I don't think I will repurchase this. It kind of disappeared after maybe an hour even. So I don't know about this. Hello Halo from Wet n Wild. Was not impressed with that. Um, so then I also purchased a Milani lip gloss in Nude Shimmer and this is really good. It's quite a large, I mean I'll show you the difference here, it's quite big. Um, this is the concealer that I just showed you. But um, it's quite big, but this is the way it looks. I mean it is really pretty on the lips. I really love this lip gloss. I think I will repurchase but I think this is going to last quite a while so I don't have to worry about re repurchasing anytime soon. I was quite happy with this and I like Milani as the brand. I love it. I love the lip gloss eyeshadow so so but I do love the lip gloss and the foundation for Milani is really good. So this was 02 Nude Shimmer quite happy with this. And then I picked up another L'Oreal um, item. This is the 8 hour Pro Gloss Infallible and I got it in the shade Sunset. I actually picked up two of these because I loved it so much. It's number 415. It's kind of a pinky shimmery pink. Um, I was quite happy with this. I don't like an applicator like this. I just don't feel like you can get a lot on there, but um, this is Sunset. It's really pretty over like a pink lipstick. Very happy with that, and it's supposed to last eight hours, and you know it does not last eight hours. Lip gloss does not last eight hours. But anyway, um, I was very happy with that. And then 
I got another, I love L'Oreal by the way. I love their mascara. I think it's my favorite of all time. I love their mascara. I love the lipstick. Um, what else do I love about L'Oreal? I love the foundation. I just love L'Oreal. I have majority of L'Oreal in my makeup bag. But I purchased this lipstick and I really do not know the name of this. It's number 207 and what it is is you have on this side you have the lip gloss and it actually is more than a gloss. It really stays and then you use this side after this dries you use this side to cover it up and it stays for a very long time. Literally, I wore this at work on Friday and I did not have to even touch up my lipstick whatsoever. I ate, um, I drank, I mean, I did everything and this would not budge. I don't even remember the name of this. Isn't that terrible? I don't know the name of this, but it's a dual ended here um, lipstick. It's kind of like a gloss slash lipstick. I, I don't know, but it lasts forever and I have it on right now. Love this so much. I will repurchase that. And like I said, that was in number 207. And then I also picked up, um, what is this brand? It's so bad that I don't know this brand. It's the Sexy Mother Pucker Pillow Plump. Um, you put it on your lips and it's supposed to plump your lips. So it comes out almost like a gloss. Oh, I put a lot out. Shoot, shoot. Probably shouldn't have done that. I don't like to waste product. That was a lot. But anyway, this is Pillow Plump and it's supposed to plump your lips and um, it kind of tingles a little bit. So I'm going to put a little bit on so I'm not wasting it. It's okay. It kind of tastes like candy. A little bit. And it says XXL on it so you're supposed to have huge lips after you put this on. It was okay. I actually picked up two of these. I think I got them as a sample like they just gave them to me. Yeah, it tastes pretty good kind of tingling that's what you would expect from a plumping lip gloss but I'm quite happy with this I don't know if I'd purchase it but um big lush lips from soap and glory that's the brand sorry soap and glory so it's it's okay very very shiny and smooth so I was okay with that so anyway um, that's it for the makeup and then I felt like I need you know I buy uh, facial moisturizer that has sunscreen in it normally but I thought you know what I'm gonna pick up a facial uh, SPF lotion that I can just wear uh, so I'm actually getting enough SPF because I'm so paranoid about that that I'm gonna age my face is gonna start aging so I think we're all worried about that but I picked up the Hawaiian Tropic silk hydration oil-free lotion sunscreen weightless face Feels if it's feels if, as if it's barely on, it says. And it's a SPF 30, 12 hour moisturization. And it smells like suntan lotion, of course. And I really like this. Um, it's a smaller um, container, so I can take it when I travel. Don't have to worry about security, airline. So um, this is perfect. I think I would repurchase. I think this is going to last me forever though because I need to start wearing more sunscreen. And speaking of tanning, I think I found my favorite tanner of all time, my self tanner. Bondi Sands I got at Walgreens. So good. I am not kidding. So I picked up, I probably have four of these right now. Um, self tanning foam and I got it in dark I don't know if there's another shade but my lips are really tingling um, 
it's salon quality coconut scent and it comes in like a pump right here and it's bondi sands and i loved it so much that i picked up a liquid gold self tanning dry oil coconut scent so i've used the same it's the same thing as this except it's not a foam it comes out brown and of course they sell a mitt so you have to buy the mitt i mean you don't have to but i i love using this mitt it doesn't fall off my hand and it's soft and I just pump and I just rub it all over and I'm, I'm not kidding it's immediate brown I mean you look like you have actually been on vacation so uh, my fiance loved it so much that I got one for him too um, so now I have to hide mine so he doesn't use it but I love Bondi Sands I did not even know that this was gonna be good but um, I just love it they're $24 each I don't know how much this one was, but I am so pleased with this. I use it probably every thir three days, maybe. Every three days, kind of touch up a little bit. It's just so nice. The smell is wonderful, very coconutty, and it lasts forever, and that's the most important part about it. It lasts a very long time, and it also looks very real. So, very happy. Can I say very anymore? Very happy with this purchase. Um, and I'm so glad that it's at the drugstore so I don't have to purchase it online or go to Ulta. It's like right down the street. So I'm very happy with this. Uh, and I think that's about it. And my lips are totally tingling right now. Gosh, this won't go away. But anyway, I'm kind of happy with this. So that's it for today. That's all I purchased at Walgreens. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also like the video if you did like it. And I will see you next time in my next video.